On a cold winter's day, I can think of nothing more inviting than the smell of cinnamon and pancakes in the pan. Certainly my children will love it. Milk is not a good idea in a pancake and I make my pancakes light by using water. Today I'm going to show you an easier way to mix your pancake batter by simply using a stick blender and you won't end up with a whole zinc full of dishes. So if you're ready to cook, let's do it. Right, to mix our pancake batter is as simple as adding a few wet ingredients, mixing the dry ingredients and then use your stick blender to make the batter. I'm going to break a few eggs in here. Next is our cup of oil and about 20 millilitres of vinegar. Now you just mix it all together with your stick blender and then you start adding your water. Your dry ingredients are simple. You add your flour, baking powder and your bicarb. Mix it all together and then spoon by spoon, you mix it into your batter. It's easy to work from a jug. When you start baking the pancakes, you can simply just pour enough into a pan. And also, this is enough for about 30 pancakes, so there's plenty to go around for everybody. Our batter is done. It's in a jug for easy pouring. I put a pancake pan on the stove and it's nice and warm now. Simply add the pancake batter. Swirl it around. And you wait for the pancake batter until it starts forming bubbles. You'll see it curls up here on the ends and it's telling you this pancake is almost ready to be flipped over. You don't want your pancake to be too brown. You just want it like a pale pancake color to it. Okay, I think we're ready. Tip it out and you're ready for pancake number two. It's an old wife's tale that you should warm pancakes or keep them warm on a pot of boiling water. You will end up with one sticky mess. Keep them in a plate and when you're ready, add cinnamon sugar and roll them up. But don't warm it up on boiling water. I'm gonna keep on baking some more pancakes because the children are on their way from school. I'll see you in my kitchen, same place, same time next week. Thank you for joining me.